So if you follow any of my videos, you'll notice that I recently talked about how uh, Patrick Bittatore was fined $35 million by the Vantage Group. And this was passed in a recent court ruling in London. Now, part of the things that I noticed in that, in that, in that court case was this one thing. Patrick Bitature and Ham Chigundu had used that same loophole. It's an international company coming to Uganda and this international company lends a Ugandan entity money. Now, after this Ugandan entity has been lent money, they go ahead and use the law to say, you know what, since I have been lent and these guys who are maybe from South Africa or from Nairobi don't have the mandate to lend here or the license to lend here, uh, these guys are choosing not to pay those loans. But in your opinion, how do you think that is going to impact us long term? Do you think just by these reputable businessmen doing this, it means that you, the normal business person in the future, won't be able to raise money to, uh, from international investors? In your opinion, how do you think that loophole in the law is going to impact us? Should international companies be lending us or should any, any regulation be adjusted to cater for international money coming into Uganda. Leave your opinion in the comments. That's all from me today, folks.